how to upload image files to Firebase Storage or video files or any other file that you like to upload. We start with two buttons to select and later upload a file to Firebase. Firstly, we select the file. In this case, we pick a file using the file picker package. With this, we can select any file type from the local phone storage. Next, we get a result with this picked file that we want to save within our state. And lastly, we use this picked file to show a preview in our app. So in this case, we display the name of the file that we have picked. Alternatively, you can display any other preview. And now we upload this file to Firebase. Simply convert the picked file to a file object. Also define where you want to store the file on Firebase. In this case, we include the name of the picked file. And lastly, upload the file to Firebase using the Firebase storage package. In your Firebase console, go to the storage section and click on get started. Simply check out this video where I explain in only two minutes how to set up Firebase if you have never done this before. And now select test mode and click on next. Next, you can choose any location for your Firebase server and click on done. With this, we can upload this file from our Flutter app to Firebase. Refresh your website and you see he has created a files folder and inside of it is our uploaded file. Next, we create an upload task. With this, we can wait until the file upload is finished. And when it is finished, then we get the download link of the uploaded file. With this, if we upload a file, then we get the download link of this file that we could open up inside a browser. Next, below the upload button, we create a progress. And with the help of a stream builder, we get then the progress of our upload. And lastly, we display this progress within our UI. Therefore, we create a stack and inside of it, we have a linear progress indicator and a text of the progress. With this, if you upload a file, then you also see the progress of the file upload. To make this work, we go to the upload file method and wrap the upload task around with the set state. And after the upload is finished, we set the upload task to null.